Good morning. We slept into 10, stayed in bed till 12, and are having our first down day. Now we're just about to go into town to get some brickie and just explore a little. Today is Sunday, but first I think pancakes and bakery. We're actually craving sugar this morning too. Apparently there's an amazing bakery up here, but the problem is we're in lay at the end of the season. It's the, it's the start of winter. So basically the whole town shuts down. And I'm afraid that the bakery is shut down. And we're afraid that the bakery is shut down. Oh wait, let me just turn around and give you this little view of one of the monasteries up the top there. What? First okay, left. First left. Yeah, first left. Yes, yeah. Okay. This isn't the bakery we were looking for, but I just saw milk free, raw vegan smoothies. So the raw vegan bakery and all the bakeries are closed. They closed a month ago. Now we've just been told that we can actually get some pancakes here. So instead of walking around trying to find something else, we're going to go for it. This lady is so funny. She just asked me if the kids are ours. And when I said yes, she said, don't lie, don't lie. We're getting that all the time. It's hilarious. Careful. You know, dogs get crazy. Careful. Yes. Yeah, all our wild dogs, so we're just moving this into the sun. Hello. Animal, always something crazy. Yeah, sometimes they happen something, you know, then it's difficult. Oh. Uh, this is yogiti. This is kawati. And yogiti means that all the, you know, helps together. Vegan custard. Vegan porridge, and we've got some vegan pancakes coming. Just stumbled upon the coolest little bookshop cafe. Check it out. Heaps of amazing books. We've got something sweet, brownies, and books. So we're back at our room after a bit of a walk around town and a little bit of shopping. And anyway, I wanted to give you a little bit of a plastic update because we've been doing really good and any plastic that we have consumed, we've been photographing to put on the blog. And it's been very, very minimal. No plastic water bottles. But last night we went to dinner up the road and we had to we couldn't finish it all and we didn't want to waste the food so we had to get the rest of the fried rice takeaway and it came in a plastic bag but it looks like a durable plastic bag i wonder if we can wash it out and use it anyway yeah. tell me how is eating rice out of a plastic bag the next day i'm so angry it's cold i need to put on weight <laughs> But don't film that. What? Ew. But it's not good. Don't spill it on the bed. No, I'm not. Oh my god, he's going for the second bag of rice. You're going to eat? Nah, I'm not eating it. That's I want to go get some nuts and fruit. Okay. It's really cold. It's Once you come into the hostel around this time, it's what, 5.30? It's almost impossible to go back outside, it's so cold. Anyway, pretty simple day today, not much to share, but Lay is interesting. It's definitely at the end of the season. We actually met a shop owner today who's closing his shop tomorrow, and he's gonna be heading back over to Kashmir to Srinagar in a couple of days. And we're hoping that we can maybe join him in a local taxi because it's going to be a lot cheaper. So essentially, we've got a couple of days left here, maybe four days left in the Himalayas in India in total. Then we make our way back across to Nepal for our trek, which is coming up. So a lot of 
kind of, um, let's say, potentially tough travel legs coming up. And then a brutal <laughs> 12-day trek. But I think the trek's going to be amazing and a huge change from all the bus trains and cars that we've been in so far. Anyway, voila for today. Catch you tomorrow. Hope you're enjoying the vlogs of our Crossing Asia expedition where we're traveling from India to Japan with no planes and no plastics. Two kids, a gypsy and a vagabond.